Well, imagine dealing with so much tragedy and chaos in your life, you have no idea what's normal to you. For one Bald Eagle football player, that nightmare was his reality, but it hasn't stopped him from moving forward. Football and Caden Binninger go hand in hand. A connection as long as he can remember. Ever since I could walk, I was just always throwing a football, always in the backyard playing catch. And nobody he enjoyed throwing with more than his dad, David. Playing catch with him was one of the, some of the best memories I've ever had. Growing up, Caden's childhood was anything but stable, except he didn't know it. I thought it was normal because I was always happiest with my siblings. I moved probably more than a dozen times, switching schools and whatnot, meeting new people and never fitting in. At age six, his house burned down. I just remember my brother shook me, woke me up, and said the house is on fire, we gotta get out. We just left that night and just went to my grams, stayed the night, had to get a new place. Just the beginning of his roller coaster. Well, I remember it was me and my sister, we were in my house in Zion, and my mom and dad just didn't come home one day. And then it was sad, and we didn't know what to do. Keaton's dad battled drug addiction, spending the next few years in and out of prison. I just knew I had to stay strong and just take care of myself and like have my grand be there for me and all my family members. On October 26, 2016, he got a call that would change his life once again. I remember I went to the hospital to say our goodbyes. One day later, Keaton's father passed away. It was kind of hard to come back from that, but I just had to work hard and try to make my dad proud. I'll see him one day. Just... That same day, Binninger honored his dad the only way he could, on the field. You know, when he did it, you know, I'll be honest with you, I about half jokes me up even to say it, but you know, it was it was a moment that I'll never forget. Caden scored his first ever touchdown. Emotional, because I just scored and it was for him. I wish he could have saw it, but I know he could see it from above. It was, it was a fantastic moment for him and for his family. And he's never looked back. Show how much they, you know, football can do for somebody. Um, just the success and the focus that they have put into it, you know, that can probably change their lives forever. Yeah, I've been through mm. so much, and they're back in the quarterfinals once again. Uh, one thing I thought was kind of cool was when the house burned down, the one thing that he still has from what he took was a stuffed animal he looks at, and he, I asked him, would you ever want to go through this again? He goes, yeah, because it helped shape me to who I am wow. today. And it was, you know, a kid who doesn't really open up, it was kind of a powerful message yeah, right strong, there. strong, strong young man. a lot of strength. Yeah.